Hi, everybody. Um, thank you for coming. Um, I'm Keiji Shinohara. And um, um, I'm uh, probably some people don't, don't know me. Uh, so I I'm, I'm teach uh, pre making and then sumi painting at the uh, art department at Wesleyan University. I've been here about, this is my 17th year. Um, so, and then um, for this group, I'm kind of outsider uh, because this is mine, <laughs> by the way, <laughs> um, because I'm only one of this group uh, living and outside of Japan. And then uh, uh, my main uh, working area is Jap United States. Um, I have a gallery in Japan, but it's mainly my activity in the people. Um, Patrick mentioned that it's after Lehman Shock, it's art market drop. And before that, there is 83 bubble bus of that. It's really affected to artists. And then so a bunch of artists get together, uh, give, not for ourselves, give young upcoming artists to opportunity to show in a different area of Japan. And also other thing is um, galleries are reduced, uh, taking Minimum artists, not many artists, and the plus, there's the Japan. There's over 25 competitions all over Japan. Now shrinking because there are no funding. So young people does not have any opportunity to showing or coming out from. Izumi, who is also who is who is like my age, uh, she graduated at uh, Uman University, Uman Art University in uh, Tokyo, and uh, she's still a teacher over there. She's a very established artist, and uh, you know she does a wonderful lithography. And then uh, other one is uh, Inoue. Look at this one. It's very, really kind of starting a very trendy way to do the woodcut. If you look into this block, this woodcut, only area was cut. It's this area and that area. Only two areas cut. Other, it's sort of more retreated the lithography. So after that cut was made, it just uh, painted to wood. The let them absorb ink and then print it out. So it's a carving with a few in the made. It's um, that's direction go to more or less working. Uh, so that's you look at it, there's a, like a one, two, three, but it's probably only two plate. Only two plate being used. That Kugo, probably everybody wow wooing about, and he's really, really upcoming artist. He's been really stalling all the price in the, uh, uh, different competitions. Um, it's, you can look at it, how many color you think, how many blocks in this one? There's only yellow, red, black. There's only three block in uh, this. Um, he's not so well in the United States. He's been really winning in the European competitions, the Biennale and the stuff. So he's watch out. And the next, so he's upcoming artist. Uh, Kimura Shigeki, other hand, is a well known and internationally, mostly Europe. And he is very successful as a commercial artist who is doing all kinds of cover of books and uh, illustrations. And uh, that, you know, so it's next to it, you see it a really good really upcoming to the already established artist. Furutani, which is uh, my favorite uh, artist, is uh, coming. She's teaching at Tama University in the uh, Tokyo, Kanto district area. And uh, you can look at it. She does that kind of egg home all over. Always he does, she does is egg home. And then there's like a little. And the other um, my etching, my favorite is uh, Imari Shigeki. That's, it's, he's, um, he's a president. He's step out, step down, but he is a president of uh, uh, Japan uh, Print Association, which is the biggest uh, uh, organization in the print in uh, Japan. Um, uh, if you look at it, um, she, he is really amazing about combining with etching with its mounting gold leaf or silver leaf. Um, this one, you can still see it, there's a gold leaf in the touch. That is a, his signature thing. It's a etching and the gold leaf put together. From this group, 
is a Fudezuka, who is also, a, he be showing a lot work in the United States. He just finished a show at, I think it's, uh, what is it? Uh, uh, Portland, gallery in the Portland, Oregon. So he been known, he been collected so many uh, museum. I think one of them, I think Cleveland Museum has his work. He does, is very simple etching. And then, and then, it's first a little bit disappointed because this is the only mezzotint we have here. Because you know, tradition in Japan, the mezzotint is very strong. Hamada was that, that Tokyo University also, she, that, that, this artist also coming from Tokyo University. All right, is that kind of tradition of mezzotint is strong. And um, because we like a long suffering work. <laughs> long, only you, you make a this size that takes about like two days, you look, locking, locking, locking. So it's, I was really surprised to see the only one piece of that. Yokohara, I know her well. Um, she's also sort of living in Japan, but she's more active in the United States. And then this is really, really different than she usually does. She's more like a color field, but this is a little bit different. Um, I want to focus about this three. That, that three pieces. There's a, one teacher, uh, they're the student of that. Wakazuka, he's a teacher and teaching at uh, uh, Sendai, uh, Tohoku Bijutsu University, art university, student of his. You can look at it, it's a style of it. Of course, he's really established artist and the, the, the upcoming artist, but it's really wonderful to see in the, it's particularly this and this, how they're using the colors, how they use the space. It's pretty much like a relationship with that, too. This artist, um, he's also a very well-known artist. He does lots of cover books, illustrations. Other one is a Kobayashi etching. Um, he does kind of abstract, sort of like a kind of uh, patterns. That's that. He's also showing in the United States. But anyway, it's those work, it's kind of a small work. Reason we set up that size is you can go any uh, store to buy frame and you just strip along. This one is actually it's because of the scheduling here. It's this one happens. They made ha uh, we made yeah, this show was on the last year, so year 2010 was traveling show, 20, 20 different city in Japan. And we already made second version, and then we already did a show in year 2011. So this is all the, all the stuff and showing it. When we did this, we were told we have to do something, a theme about Christmas. But <laughs> you can see uh, some of them are nothing related with Christmas. Even I didn't do it, but it just it was difficult.